What's up guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do image classification in JavaScript with the help of Hugging Face AI models. So the first thing I want to do, I think I just want to show you this picture with just for you to have context. So this is just the picture of an ox, or at least I think so. <laughs> and um, the first thing I want to do is just to initialize my NPM project on my Node.js project by using NPM init. I don't care about any of that. I'm just going to go enter, enter, enter. Then after that, I want to install the module that we're going to use. I'm sure if you have watched my previous video on Hugging Face uh, models, you understand where this is coming from. Xenova or Zenova. I don't, know really, I don't really know how to pronounce it. Transformers. Okay, install the package. Okay, so now it is done. So the next thing we want to do is we just want to go to package and we want to change this to become now not common JS, but to become a module because we want to use ES5 um, features and ES6, not really sure. I mix them a bit sometimes. Okay, and then I go and I create a new JavaScript file. So if you think this is not very beginner friendly, please write in the comments, but I'm just trying to assume that you know a little bit of JavaScript and not waste your time telling you how to, or teaching you how to do things you already know. So once I'm here, the first thing I want to do is I want to import pipeline. Um, I want to import pipeline, not from stream, but from, yes, it's in over slash transformers, okay. And I want to now initialize now a pipe for us to use. And we're going to say, okay, and this is an async function pipeline. And we want to tell what this pipeline is for. So the task that we want to accomplish is we want to do image classification. And you can here specify a specific model that you want to use. Just know that different models have different sizes and all of that. Some models are smaller, some are bigger. So Depending on what model you choose, it will take time. I prefer to use the default one for this tutorial because it's going to be quicker to download and not the best or the most accurate, but it's usually more quicker and the best to kind of experiment with. Okay, after initializing our pipe, I want to just create a variable. It can actually be a constant because we're not going to reassign. A result, which is going to be a weight, and we're going to process an image. So you must provide here an absolute path of the image. Now you can go ahead and use um, image uh, import dot meta and all of that, figure out the absolute path. It should probably be two lines of code or three lines of code, but this tutorial is not really about any of that. So I'm just gonna copy the string of the absolute path and paste it in here. This is basically our image here. And after that, um, I'm gonna do this and I want to console.log the result. Okay, save, and I can come here and say node index. So if it's your first time, um, it's also going to download that um, AI model that you need to use, and that may take time. And this sometimes doesn't really, in fact, in my case, it never really shows me the progress. So I think I just need to check. It's probably somewhere here where I can specify that it must also log the the progress of console is not a function. Okay, console.log. Console.log. Node index. Okay, and there we go. So it tells us, okay, that is an ox and the percentage or the score or the possibility is 98% or even almost 99%. But however, we want to see the other options that it matched. Maybe we want to see um, top six. So I use this property top K and you want to see six, for example, and if we rerun that, you'll see that now we see six. It's an ox, 90, almost 99%, 0%. If we round it down, if we see it or something like that, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%. So it is definitely an ox according to this model. And yeah, that was basically the tutorial, and I hope you did enjoy it, and I hope it didn't waste your time. If you like content such as this, please do like and subscribe, and yeah, watch more as it comes along. Thank you for watching.